So it's finally time to jump back into Ben 10 with season two. I put out a poll not too long ago, and a lot of the community here on YouTube seem to want more Ben 10. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to check out the first episode, and I'm excited to learn more about Grandpa Max's past now that we know that he has a history with Vilgax. Before we jump in, though, do me a favor. If you want more Ben 10, you got to hit that like button. And if you're new here and you've been enjoying the content, why haven't you subbed yet? Do it now. It looks like we're not opening up with Grandpa Max. We're opening up with some government facility or something. What is... Oh, yeah, it doesn't seem too good. Wait a second, bro. These pesky aliens are causing World War Three, dude? The heck, dude? Oh, it's Vilgax. That's his ship, isn't it? I'll never forget the cookie designs on his ship, dude. Oh, that's Vilgax, right? Why does he look skinnier? Uh... That's not Vilgax. That's one of his people, I guess. It's over, Vilgax. You're going down. It is Vilgax. Oh. This is the past? Phil? Yo, Phil's about to get messed up. Yo, you bit out more than you could chew, Phil. That must be Grandpa Max. So we are learning about his past. All right, let's go, let's go, let's go. Truth. Oh, it's time to learn the truth, isn't it? Kind of looks like Grandpa Max's build. Never said I would, kid. It's it's definitely Grandpa Max, dude. And I'm guessing he's a little bit more of a veteran here too, because he called that dude kid. So he must have seniority on him. Okay, Grand Grandpa Max was him even back then, huh? <laughs> Yo, what? He looks like you're blasting off again, Vilgax. What the hell? Out with a bang. Yo, look at him, bro. Young Grandpa Max. And then Kablamo. <laughs> no more Vilgax. That's what you think, though, because, you know, you did that to him in the past and he came back and he just did it to him again and he's more than likely going to come back, bro. We called ourselves the plumbers. So they are called the plumbers. Officially, we didn't exist. We were the guys who fixed the problems no one else could. Ex the Ghostbusters? <laughs> Extraterrestrial. Extrasensory. Okay. Extraordinary. I like that. It's cool. So I've been going hero. I've really been following in your footsteps. I'm a plumber in training. Honestly, that's a great way to look at it. Bro, are we going to see him actually become a plumber and fight alongside other plumbers? My hero days are over a long time ago. I don't know about that. Well, now that Vilgax is back. Started. Ben, wait. Time to accelerate. Is he going to get the right one? Nope. Oh. kind of creature inside tearing up the place sorry just needed a moisturize <laughs> he's feeling a little dry dude okay who's the punk giving us creatures of bad yeah what what monster is it what is that thing oh it's slobber <laughs> what <laughs> what i could have sworn that thing was gonna be huge it's a little, it's a little baby monster just drooling all over himself. Somebody get him a bib. <laughs> exactly. It's a perfect response. It's going to get bigger though. Watch. Oh, well, it packs some punch. Grandpa Max probably knows what that is, right? Being a plumber and all. All you did was uh, cool him off, dude. That's just a breath of fresh air to me. Thank you. He's probably like, I appreciate that. That's his buddy, bro. That's the dude from the past. Yo, this is cool. Ben's about to meet his grandpa's old partner that he saved in that flashback against Vilgax. Vilgax. Uh, Gax. This is cool, dude. Meet another plumber, bro. Looks like this guy's still up and running, huh? He didn't retire. Today's my lucky day. But he was younger than Max, Two right? For the price of one. Might want to get in here, Max. Fish stick. I'll be back in a minute. This thing really is a menace. Wow, is he okay? It doesn't look like it. All right, Ben's gonna save him, and this guy's gonna see it and be like an alien helping me. Wait, wait, you're just a kid? And why do you look like my old partner? <laughs> he put on the fake voice. Ben, are you all right? <sighs> Barely. Some nut job in there nearly roasted me. Your old partner. Max. Phil. What's up, Philip? <laughs> you know the 
this guy, Grandpa? Well, you could say that. We used to be partners. First episode back is awesome. Love it. Once you took Bill Gax out of the picture, the work just seemed to dry up. Yeah, well, about I'm that. Just doing my job. He's back. Yeah. Anyway, looks like things are picking back up again. In fact, I'm starting my own freelance plumber business. Bro, he has no. Wow. Cool watch. If Grandpa knew about like rumors and scuttlebutt, as he called it, about the the watch, then he must have heard things about the watch too, right? Or no? It looks so familiar. There it is, bro. It ought to. It's the Omni. Oh, look at the time. Well, we need. Why is he trying to hide this so much, man? Happy plumbing. Hmm. I wonder what Grandpa's holdup is. You didn't tell Bill about the Onitrix. That's on a need-to-know basis only, Ben. Okay. Less people know the better. Being cautious. Yes, that's your answer to everything, Though isn't Phil's it? already wrapped up in all this, man. He's a plumber. Why don't we start off the plumbers again? You, me, and Phil. Let's do it. Super Let's do it, dude. I want to see that, man. Ben, I'm flattered you appreciate what I did, but you can't bring back the past. No. Tell You're that to trends, bro. Volpamancers tearing up a meat The heck are those? We're gonna need a little of that old magic. No worries, we're on it. Oh yo, the Phil's probably like, who is this kid? Like, why does he why is he talking such a big game? Oh yo! Friends of yours? It looked like his one his one monster, right? His one alien. Doesn't it it doesn't look like one of Ben's aliens? Wild Mutts! Yeah! Oh, how's Phil going to react to this? <laughs> is he going to get the right one? He is. All right. At least he got the right one this time, dude. That's why I recognize that watch. It's the Omnitrix. So, um, who wore the Omnitrix before him? Because now it's, it's starting to sound like what Grandpa Max was saying about rumors is not true because he knows exactly what it is. Oh wow, he's much smaller than, than those ones. That was cool. Do they run off of heat signatures? Because it looked like Ben was seeing their heat, heat signatures. So they call these things Volpamancers, but Ben calls them Wild Mutt. So I'm guessing Volpamancer is the actual alien uh, name. Sorry about that, Ben. Only way to bring down the Volpamancer. Yeah. Lucky for us, you had a sonic pitch whistle with you. Sonic pitch whistle. The Omnitrix really does exist. And Ben, pretty good. So they were rumors. Okay, they were rumors. You know, Ben, you'd make a great plumber. There it is, the encouragement that Grandpa Max doesn't want him to get. We'll chip off the old block. We'd all make a great team. With your powers, Max's experience, and my instinct. What about Gwen? I'm thinking what an odd coincidence for a hyper weasel and two mega mutts to turn up on the same day. Aliens. Go figure. I uh, need some. Yeah, something, something smelling a little fishy here, huh, Grandpa Max? I wonder if this guy is mad that Max retired and, you know, disassembled the plumbers. And now he's causing these aliens to show up so he gets Max to come back, maybe? Wasn't Mount Rushmore missing a head there, dude? Looking for this. The null void projector. Oh, he's been raiding the armory. Those aliens were familiar. You stole oh, he let them out? To release the ones we okay, so he the is causing this to happen. Why are you doing all this? Job security. <laughs> I release an alien, then get some hotel manager or mayor or whoever to pay me to catch it. So it's not to get him to open up the, the, the business again. So he's because he's been doing this for years, obviously. Right. Because how long has this been? Have they been separated? Got to make money, I guess. <laughs> Easy money. Kind of took the money away from Max. Away with this. Yeah, it's putting people in harm's I way, though. You might say that. Too bad. We could have made quite a team again. <laughs> Damn, bro. He's like, you're going. Dude, I thought he was gonna send Max in there, but no, we're just bringing something else out. I'll be sure to tell Ben how your last words to me were how you wanted him to follow in your footsteps. Wow, this guy's a scumbag, bro. <laughs> Are you serious? I mean, money motivates, huh? There we go. Blink and you'll miss it, dude. You're nothing but a big drip. Scumbag, dude. Put people in harm's way. We don't need your grandpa. We could start back up the plumbers again. Just you and me.
Yo, bro, I think you're barking up the wrong tree. It doesn't matter how much he wants to be a plumber. He ain't gonna turn his back on his family, dude. A Wigzellian or beast. Wigzellian? Org beast. So I'm guessing the Wigzellians or whatever created that thing? I wonder if Phil's gonna show back up, bro. If he's gonna be like in this story again. <laughs> yeah, let me just kick you in the face a little bit, dude. No. Well, this is his armory, so he kind of knows where things are, right? No. No. It's been a while, though. <laughs> he doesn't quite remember. Got it. A Pokeball? Imagine, dude. All uh, right, it's just a, I guess a gas bomb, bro. Knocks his ass out. And who says cry doesn't pay? <laughs> um, Gwen's in the car, so we're not going to have Gwen next episode. We're going to have to go get Gwen back or. <laughs> My man's like, it's time to bring out the big guns, dude. My man's got, he got thrusters, dude. All right, man. About that old dinky RV, huh, Phil? It's got some upgrades, bro. Yeah, I hope this guy doesn't mess up his ride. <laughs> mess up his ride, bro. He's pretty proud of it. I kind of hope he does mess it up, actually. Um, um, um. I wouldn't toss that out the window. If that breaks, what happens? Does it open up a portal permanently, or is it just break? Yeah, I tell you what, man. Gwen always comes in clutch, bro. He's come in clutch so many times in season one, you know. Yo, Max is pissed. How dare you do this, Phil? That giant, like, moth jellyfish? Okay, Ben, I don't think it is either. Might be the state bird of that dimension, though. The big red guy, dude? Or is it the green one? He got the wrong one. Yeah, bro. Not, 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 not brains, dude. I mean, it's too smart. He doesn't even understand himself. Oh, bro. How, how is he struggling with a, with a little girl <laughs> to get that back? Like, what? Well, then you're all gonna be very busy. Bro, she's gonna reflect it back to him. Is this man about to go to this dimension? Oh, my goodness, bro. Okay. He'll be back. I definitely wouldn't want to be a... He, well, you kind of wanted to be a plumber at one point, Ben. Just not that type of plumber. Dude, that dude's gonna be back, right? Phil's gonna come back with a vengeance at some point? Maybe. And for what it's worth, Ben, you would have made a great plumber. Both of you. Hey, we're your grandkids. What do you expect? That's right, man. Did the bloodline. I feel like we're gonna see them restart the plumbers at some point. I think there's some things about this job we're better off not knowing. How do you know he didn't have partners or something? He didn't have, like, you know, some people that were working for him. Who knows, dude? He'll be back. He's 100% going to come back, bro. I wouldn't be surprised if he comes back with, like, aliens from that realm or something to, you know, get revenge on them. Great first episode. It explored Grandpa Max's past, his partner when they were plumbers. Ben wanting to be a plumber, but I feel like that's not going to happen anytime soon. But I do feel like the plumbers will be restarted at some point. I think that'd be pretty cool. Maybe, who knows? Maybe there's people out in the you know the universe doing the job that he doesn't you know, he doesn't know about and Phil doesn't know about. Maybe there's more plumbers somewhere. Maybe there's another group fighting evil aliens like Vilgax. I'm sure we're gonna get like more world building and the lore and everything's gonna expand as the seasons go on. But we're gonna watch a second episode. Let's go. Uh, nothing like. Finally relaxing in the peace and quiet of the great outdoors. Astronomers at Mount Hamilton have caught a glimpse of a small meteor, and it appears to be headed toward the northwest part of the state. Oh, uh, what's, what's on the meteor? Anything? Accelerate, hit that burger place in Casper. <laughs> Pick up a double cheeseburger with pickles. And we can live right off the land. Oh, we're not living off the land like that, Grandpa Max. Rubworms. Full of protein. Maybe I can help. <laughs> yeah, Gwen, I'm on the same page with you. I like camping, but you know, I'd rather uh, make some burgers and hot dogs or something, dude. Yeah, I don't think this big guy's going fast. Is this a new monster? A new monster, bro. A new alien. Now that's a heroic pose. Real funny. What is that? 
I wonder what his powers are, man. It looks cool as hell. Not that. <laughs> Maybe he sucks things up like Kirby, dude. Hmm, what could this thing do? Eat things? I don't know. It looks like a tank. No way. There's the meteor. He's going to eat it. Eat the meteor, bro. Eat it. What's he going to do? Yo, I'm really, really excited to find out what this alien can do. And if we're going to see some other new aliens as well. This alien's got a cold. Oh, yo. He can tuck and roll, dude. The big tick. Okay, I think we found this thing's power. An awfully big meteor, right? That doesn't look like a meteor right to me. It looks like a ship or something, dude. We come in peace. <laughs> Max, imagine. We come in peace. Yeah, it ain't a meteor, right, bro? Dude. <laughs> we got a giant blood sucker. It looks mechanical, though, doesn't it? Oh, no. It doesn't look mechanical, actually. No, it kind of does look mechanical. I guess it's just a hard outer shell, right? Who are these? Rejoice. He's arrived in all his glorious glory. Who <laughs> are you guys, bro? These guys look like they got some religious connotation to them. That's a crazy looking blade back there. It looks like there's liquid inside of it, right? And this guy looks like he's uh, the coward of the group, maybe. Hmm. This de guy definitely looks like a religious zealot. I await his proclamation. What? Who are you guys? Relax. We come in peace. They worship this tick. Always say right before they blow you to bits. They actually said we come in peace, bro. <laughs> Is he not tremendous? Tremendous. Oh, yeah. Hail the tremendous one. <laughs> yeah. Let's not. Let's not hail that, dude. Actually, closer than you'd think. They have to know what the Omnitrix is, right? Nothing to go back to. The Great One purified your planet last week. What? Oh, yeah, we got to stop this. They want to purify the planet? I feel like that means he's going to drain the planet. If we followed the Great One from planet to planet, galaxy to galaxy, after he paid a visit to each and every one of our planets, notice his technique. The deep burrowing of the appendages into the core of the planet, rotting it from the inside and... Yeah, we don't want that, bro. Ingesting it. Okay, Unicron. No, not quite Unicron, but you know. That's what he's going to do here? Of course. Rejoice. Rejoice. Get the heck out of here. These guys are nutcases, man. I don't think so. Religious zealots. <laughs> he's like, not on my watch. Though, Ben, that thing's awfully big. And this guy just played cricket with you. Are you serious? What now? Oh, oh, changing. damn, dude. We have to get back up that hill and destroy it before it destroys everything. Dude, it's just like, it looks like it's melting the trees. What? Whoa, these weren't here when we rolled down. <laughs> it's changing the whole freaking earth. Yo, oh, the bug thing. Forgive me, I'm not gonna know all the names, guys. I probably will never remember all the names. We really need to get you some underwing deodorant. <laughs> hey man, he hasn't he hasn't bathed in four days, bro. My man's stinky stinky. Kick him in the mouth, grandpa. Dude, look at the the river or the waterfall in the background. Yellowstone's becoming more and more poison. Poison stone, dude. What was that noise? Sounds like old faithful's ready to blow. Oh, what's gonna come out of this time? Poison could do yeah, it, does. it ain't water anymore. That's right, he shoots this like liquid out. Hmm. I love that axe, man. You better hope your wings don't get clipped, bro. Dude, my man's shooting out can get Suka Tenshos. Okay. Yeah, here's a little muck to the face. I really like the main guy. He's cool the way he's floating around. He's got that vibe to him, that style. Oh, come on, Ben. I really hope we get to see him master this thing or at least get more comfortable with it like throughout the seasons. Oh, nice. See ya. Wouldn't want to be ya, and that's for sure. 
<laughs> yeah, this is awesome. This is so cool, man. I love it. We're air surfing. And this is Ben doing it while not in an alien form, you know? He's just a kid right now. I like that transformation a lot. This alien, I think it's cool, man. Nice. We're just gonna beat the shit out of it, huh? Put a whooping on it. It didn't matter. <laughs> okay, one down, nine to go. All right, so we're, I feel like the fire one could work, but I guess not, huh? It's heat resistant? Hmm. None of it's working. I bet you that new that new alien's gonna come into play, huh? Bring out the new one, Ben. I give. This thing's indestructible. We're back. Dude, what? They got free. It's time for the final purification of your planet. And you three along with it. Yeah, let's not. <laughs> let's not do that. I don't know, Gwen. Do you? I mean, he didn't try the final, the, the new alien yet, right? Could this get any nastier? Oh, I guess it could. Oh, <sighs> it looked like maggots to me, bro. That was nasty. Running out of time. And aliens. I went everybody. No, you didn't. Not exactly everybody. No way. I am not turning into. You have to. Again. Give it a well, try, bro. I don't even know if I could. Destroy them all. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I, I, I guess you've been holding that in your back pocket this whole time. <laughs> I want to see what this giant tick's gonna turn into. Hmm. Hmm. Dude, it's acidic. It's melting the ground. Time to rock and roll. Let's go, Ben. Let him hide. Oh, can he like cause earthquakes? Because he was, like, causing the Earth to move a little bit. Unless that was the, uh, the, the tick doing it. Okay. Okay. Hit him with your big body, Ben. Nice. Is that how you're supposed to use this? The velocity of the ball form? Yeah. And his outer exterior, his exterior, like, protects him, right? When he bounces around. Nice. He can reflect it back, too. His body must be a little bit, like, malleable, I guess, huh? Because he seemed to, like, be bouncing around, and he was able to bounce the blast back at them. Yeah, 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 yeah. Max is so cool, man. He's like, I might not got powers. I don't even got my fancy weaponry. But I can still fuck you up. Might have to do that a few hundred more times, Ben. To even make a dent. Oh, we're going in his mouth. We're entering one of its orifices. <laughs> they, they're like, no, bro. Not the pus. Damn, bro. It just destroyed its rib cage or something. <laughs> All right. I think we're about to have a pus explosion, dude. Yeah, that's gnarly. That's absolutely gnarly. I don't think anybody's going to be visiting Yellowstone anytime soon. <laughs> yeah, that four-day streak, over. All right, put these three in the null void, please, or do something to them. We don't want them coming back. We're free! No way. <laughs> no way, dude. <laughs> The other one's like, the other one's like, I'm tired of this, bro. I'm just gonna go with it, man. <laughs> He's like, whatever. Oh, wait. That's right. I forgot. You're just an underdog. <laughs> you know what they're gonna say? They're gonna be like, we ain't worshiping, we ain't worshiping some filthy human, is what they're thinking, dude. Well, when you put it that way. I don't want you worshiping me. <laughs> what the hell? By what he's thinking. Yeah, I guess we're gonna try, bro. You can't like re, can't fix the landscape here. It looks like there'll be more. Oh, to come. nice. It looks like everything's going. I guess all the life force went back to the planet. Nice job, Ben. Yeah, I'm the kid who saved the Earth. I think my work here is done. 
for now until the next episode, Ben. How about those burgers, though, man? I don't think we want grub worm today. Oh, we gotta... <laughs> oh, Ben. You missed some tick goop over there. Why is he being forced to do it? Why aren't they helping? Why is he being punished like that, man? The geyser. I wonder if the geyser is going to have any kind of scent to it or if like it's going to be normal again, right? It looks like the landscape went 100% back to normal. These first two episodes in season two were a lot of fun, but I wonder if we're going to be seeing Phil again. And I wonder if we're going to be seeing those three aliens at some point. I'm sure they're going to they're gonna go into the universe and find something else to worship, right? They can't worship Ben because he's a human. So I'm sure they're going to find something else to worship or maybe we'll never see them again. And they were just a one off, you know, character. I don't know, but I am excited to see what's going to happen next. I hope you enjoyed these reactions. If you want more Ben 10, you know what to do. As always, thanks for watching and until next time.